Welcome back, everybody. Episode 49 of the Return. I am Toasty FM. 49, almost 50. By the way, you might notice we're coming. This episode uh, would have normally come out on Monday, but we I pushed it back to Tuesday. Before I was doing Monday through Saturday, but I'm gonna switch it up now. Saturday through Sunday. Monday will be my day off from this lovely series. But anyway. I'm coming to you today, May 20th, 2026, because, and I'm not starting on the normal screen I would normally. Let's just look through our youth center, uh, under-19s. We have some very talented players. Tillin Javornik will likely be a part of our squad next season. He can play in multiple places, but uh, he will be... Um, our defensive midfielder, likely uh, behind Plantech. We also have a couple other very good players. Uh, Gregor Fliss at left back. Um, Ziga Polajek at, um, at left wing. But he'll probably be playing striker for us in the near future. He is very talented with th that 12 finishing he is very good. I think I'm playing him. Yeah, I'm, I'm training him as a striker, and he has improved fantastically, I have to say. So why? I know, I, I mean, obviously I'm showing, I came up on the screen to show you our amazing talent that we have. But there's another reason. We are the champions of the Privileja Telecom Slovenia. We are the Slovenian Premier League title champions, fantastically. And I know that I was going to come. I said I was going to come back for this last game, but then we pulled away. We pulled away. So, last few games since, uh, what game do we play? We we had this uh, Lublana game. We we lost two nil, and I said we're going to come back for Murrow. But then something special happened. We played fantastically down the stretch here. We only dropped two points in the league this entire time. We won every other game. We were on a roll. And at this point, I think we clinched it after the Skaritza game. So this game was of little consequence, essentially, right? So I decided not to play it. So as far as... Lublana goes, they sp sputtered to the end of the season, um, dropping points th three times in the last month. They only had one, three points out of the last three games of the season, um, ending at three points out of the last four games. Really tough for them. Uh, only won twice in the league down the stretch, and that you know, basically ended their title challenge. It probably, uh, well, Maribor still a ways off them. I was going to say that um, that Maribor ended up kind of being close to Lubana, but it wasn't really. But we were clear champions, and according to this, we were first throughout the season, which is not true considering Lubana, I believe, took over our spot. I don't know. But according to this, and according to the past positions thing, uh, we were champions um, from start to end. You know, the whole time we were in first place. So, whatever. Um, I'm not going to... I'm not going to uh, disagree with the game. Um, sure. Um, yeah. Let's let's go with that. I, um I'm not going to disagree with you down with the game. So, today we have a game against Bravo. Um, and we can hopefully, amazingly, get the double, which would be fantastic. At least the chance to get the double, right? We still have to beat Bravo today. And then we have um, a, a, a final set up. Or we should have a final set up against... That's the Euro Cup. Wrong thing. Um, it looks like it will be... Will be uh, Lublana probably. 
Um, they, they advanced. Those three two in the first game, three two in the second game, right? Is that what, is that what I'm saying? Dom's all three. Yeah, so it was nil nil after this game, and then they beat uh, Dom's all three two. So we have a date with Lublana, and I want revenge. I want sweet, sweet revenge. Justice says not revenge. I need revenge. So let's beat Bravo today, and hopefully we can uh, we can get that revenge. So this is lineup for today's game. We have everybody healthy. Almost. Filipovic has picked up a knock. He is out, so I'm not going to be starting him for today's game. I want us to get through that, and I want him to be ready for the final if we get there. We are also missing um, Ernest Habib. Uh, not Ernest Habib. Ernst Habib. Ernest Habib is a different person. I don't know who Ernest Habib is, but it's, he's a person. But uh, Ernst Habib is out with a torn something. Uh, damaged cruciate ligaments, his, done his ACL or MCL or one of the L's, and he was out six to nine months, now he's out five to eight months, N not the, it's a loss, it's a loss, I mean, but we do have Garentra back, and, and as you know, I, I think very highly of Garentra. Actually, let's put Panic in here, because Panic has come back and he's played fantastically as well. If you look in these games here, um, you'll see Av uh, Panic has been a very important a winner there. Uh, Yazbatch has been very good as well. Panic there. So Panic has gotten two winning goals lately. So um, we have a lot of talent in the squad, but I think it's going to be Dolchek. Um, no, it's going to be Panic on the left wing and Yazbatch on the right wing. In for where is... My boy Rogelch, who has also picked up a knock. Um, but Yazbech is more than capable of backing him up. So we are at home against Bravo. Bravo, a very good la uh, season last season. This season, not as much. But uh, it is nil-nil after the first leg. And we did uh, not beat them a few weeks ago in the league. So we have it all to do today. Um... Uh, a draw does not work for us, really. We have to beat this squad. Uh, it is not enough to um, accept uh, a 2 2 draw. If, you know, with away goals, you know, we need to beat this squad for sure. Or, you know, risk going to penalties. 22 seconds after this game. 22 seconds into this game. And, uh, yeah, Matco just, um, just not, just not paying attention. Good header. I mean, it was well placed, but, uh, you can't just let a guy undressed at the bad, uh, at the back post. So Kidrich puts them up 1-0, and that means we need two goals at least to get through. We will not be going to penalties for any penalty lovers. Um, we need to win this game outright. Jurisic, Kidrich, good challenge, Matko. Uh, hopefully this will make up for it. Prelich is going to beat this man. He does, but not able to score. Um, yeah, Matko, even with that assist, if it was an assist, would not have done it because we still would be in a losing position. Math, a way goals thing. So, uh, plan tech. Here, can we go right into a next highlight? No, we cannot. Still a lot of a lot of game to go, so I'm not, I'm not, you know. I mean, I'm worried. This is not the way I want it to to go, but you know, we have time. Uh, Glavchic here puts balls out to Yazbech. 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 He has help on the wing. Matko, redeem yourself, Matko. Redeem yourself. Oh, that works! That works! Ma okay, you're half redeemed there. Uh, Matko puts a good ball right in front of the goalkeeper. The defender, I don't know what he is doing here. I don't know what his intentions are. Both right backs not having the greatest game of their lives. Prelich 
doing exactly what he needs to do as our striker and is the first one to it. Puts the ball in the back of the net. Very well done. Glavchich here. Header. Ooh! Gorenscher. Oh! Gorenscher finds himself uncovered in the box and puts the beautiful Glavchich cross at the goal, but it hits the crossbar and we are still 1-1 here. Vidmar wins the header there, but puts it into our opposing player here. Matko, 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 Matko. Oh, what a save! What a save! Oh, what a save! Oh my goodness. I don't even know who the goalkeeper's name is. Our backup, but what a save that was. Slavicic, Glavcic wins the header there. And we stay alive here in this game. We cannot allow more goals. That is one thing we cannot do. Hafner, thank you, Hafner. What a man. Matko here. Into Gerencher. Gerencher. Well done here. Ooh, almost loses the ball. Let's lose the ball. Pavic. Come on, Gerencher. Win that ball back, baby. Panic does, though. Gerencher. Glavcic. Out to Gliha. Gliha. Gliha, do something. Panic. Good ball there. Panic beats a man. Puts out the Gliha again. Bad Panic. Panic finds Prelic. Oh, and we're just not able to score. We've had chances. We've had chances. I feel like that was a good block by the defender there on Prelic. I would have bet on Prelic to score there, but he did not. Zelchkovic, Gorencher. Back to Zelchkovic. Zelchkovic back to the goalkeeper. Hafner. Come on, Hafner. Hafner, ooh, <laughs> Hafner. Oh, you gotta get that Glavchich. I don't know what Glavchich is doing there. Good high press. Doesn't lead to anything though. Come on, Matko, win a ball. Very well done. Good job, Matko. Good job, Matko. Glavchich over to Yazbech. Yazbech, one on one with the goalkeeper. Will he score? Oh, he does not. So many chances we've had so far in this game. To put ourselves up. Just not happening yet. Garencher. Vidmer. Back. Ooh, not a great ball there by our center back. And Matko forced to make a tackle. Smart tackle there. Does not get a yellow card. Um, he was on. He was lucky there. But a good tackle. I'm, I'm, I'm liking how Matko's playing. Since... <laughs> Who else? Who else? But Glavchich from the spot kick. Whoo! The goalkeeper didn't even move. What a free kick, my man. Oh. Mwah. Mwah. Glavcic, you Serbian god. Oh. oh, oh, oh. What a free kick that was. Jesus. And we go up to one. You have turned this game around. Matt Coe will not be sold in the summer. <sighs> Whew. What a game. What a, oh my goodness, what a free kick that was. We are up and we are dominating the game. Since we allowed that opening goal, we have really tightened the screws. Come on, guys, let's play some defense. Oh, oh, we got lucky there. Oh, we got lucky. Kidrich had an open goal, basically. Just He just needed to, needed to put it on target, and he was not able to. Half hour left here. Um, Bravo are pushing a little bit. Definitely tell based on their play. Statistically, obviously, they had that chance that Kidrich had, could have had a brace, um, uh, you know, a, a historic brace for the club, but not able to. Um, going to make some changes, going to bring on Avbelge, a little more defensive than Garencher, and I'm going to bring on Girdle, no, I'm going to bring on Dolchek for Panic. Panic had a solid game, um, you know, un uh, unlucky not to have an assist on that, on that Prelich chance that got blocked, but, um, we just need to see out this game. Glavchich here. Out to Yavbelch. Yavbelch. Matko. Matko. Come on, baby. No. Yes, Matko. Woo! Matko. Matko's playing with fire, man. Matko's, uh, Matko's putting on a show for the, for the people at home. Gliha. Good ball by Gliha. What a ball! The goalkeeper had no chance. And Yazbech puts it in the back of the net. Header. Yes, boy. As we go up 3-1. Hopefully that, that, um, close up the game. Gliha, 
Great job keeping that in. Gliha, what a pull. Just loops it over the goalkeeper. The goalkeeper is put in absolute no man's land. And, and the, go the this goalkeeper is having a tough day. Uh, that ball, the free kick, that cross by Matt Coe that hits the defender... <laughs> their goalkeeper uh, not having the best game and we beat Bravo 3-1 and we are going to a cup final our first in the history of this save my first one uh, as a manager and we are gonna play Olympic Lublana the ends had it we had Nick Prelich Nemanja I believe Nemanja Glavcic and Nezh Yazbec, the ends, ends win it. Very, very well done. I mean, after 22 seconds to go down, to pull ourselves back, very well done. Obviously, Glavtich went to the match. He's a tank in mid. This guy, man, he, sh he should not be playing. He should not be playing for us. He should be playing for a Real Madrid at the base of their midfield. Maybe that's a little bit far-fetched, but he is so good, man. And he has been... I could not... I did not think he could be better than last season. But he has been better than last season. Putting in the goals now with a higher average rating, 7.87. My goodness. Jesus Christ. That is very good by, um, by him. Oh, my goodness. I just want to... Look at this guy's stats. 7-4-8. Underwhelming in the cup. One goal, but it was such a valuable, valuable goal. Oh, no, no, no. That's in the Euro Cup. Two, one goal. Eight. Woo! 8.3 games. One goal, two assists, and an 8.43 rating in the cup. Jesus, man. My goodness, he is on fire. He is a man man possessed. We have a cup final in just three days. But for you guys, it's only going to be one. Yes, unfortunately, you guys are going to come back, have to come back tomorrow for that game. We have not lost since that game against Lublana. We are going to, where are we playing this? The Lush Stick Vert uh, the home of who? I have no idea. Home of Maribor to play Lublana. And we're going to bring back some silverware. We're going to do the double. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure you guys like and subscribe. Comment down below. Make, so, make sure you go come back tomorrow to carry yourselves.